Regardless of your beliefs in a higher power, you must understand that you were not placed on this earth by accident. And we talk about hashtag life goals. It's just our uh, verbiage that we've put around this idea of breaking your life down into four areas. But we've gone through L, which is love. And we talked about relationships and the importance of being in a good place with your relationships. Then we went into I, which is influence, which is your mind. And we talked about uh, this idea of being in a good mental place. Then F, finance, which is your business. And, and we talked about um, being in a good place with your business. And lastly, E, which is energy, the body. And we had a lot of fun in this, uh, this last episode, uh, putting me through some <laughs> grueling workouts. The most important thing is having all four of these areas working together. Everyone needs accountability. It's one thing that I can look back at all the bad parts of my life, the rough stages of my life, and it was when I didn't have accountability. And so with our organization, we now have all of our agents, which are across the country. Uh, I lead them with this accountability in all four of those areas where we sit down and we have three goals in each of those four areas. Three goals over the next 90 days. What do you want to achieve? What do you want to do on a daily basis in all four of those areas? And just like you and I were talking before we got started, and, and I know you, you view all of these things through this lens of the gospel. And as we look at these areas of our life with, with relationships, with our mind, body, and business, it's looking at all of them through this lens of the gospel and, and putting kind of like this Jesus filter yeah. over it. And I used to almost make fun of this idea of work-life balance, that only people that talked about it were using it as an excuse to work less. But now I've really embraced this idea of just going all in and in, in all areas, and one of those areas being your, your faith. When we say, like, unless you're winning in all four areas, like that's, like that's where fulfillment comes from. But there's this thing that happens before that. <laughs> to be able to be winning in your relationships with your spouse, significant other, friends, family, to be able to be winning with your body, to be able to be winning with your mind, to be able to be winning in your business, truly winning, is there has to be that relationship with God. And so now that's what I want to talk to everybody about is how do we just thrive in all areas? A lot of people want to talk to you about how to be successful or how to get in good shape. I want to talk to people about how do we become successful, be in good shape, have the best relationship with your spouse, have the best relationship with your kids, have the best relationship with God. Are you meditating daily? Are you praying daily? Are you doing all those things and just excelling in, in life? And it's just a completely different perspective that's now coming from me than they heard the first year. And it's been the most fulfilling thing that I've ever done and the conversations that I've been able to have with people and the impact that I'm seeing, um, it's incredible. And it's really that moment where I was like, ah, oh, that's what it meant when they said preach. So the people that come on board uh, with our company um, over these next few months, which we know will be many of you that are watching this, we know that taking you through this process will be a life changing movement that will spread across this country. People that are winning in all areas of life and now have a career opportunity where they're making more money than they've ever made. And when you combine those two, winning in all four areas and winning it financially to a degree that you've never won before, then very interesting things can happen and that's how you can absolutely change the world. And that's what we're all about. Um, it sounds silly, change the world, but you change the world by changing the people that are in it.